hi everybody subscribe please to this channel and let's continue our historical adventures today we are in the palazzo altens is a historical building in rome designed by milots da fori and it's located uh, not so far from uh, the piazza navona this museum is a part of the roman national museum and uh, the museum is specially dedicated to the history uh, of art collection. Here you can find many ancient Roman sculptures. The building was constructed in the 15th century on the orders of uh, Girolamo Riario, nephew of uh, Pope Sixtus IV. The palace incorporates a series of pre-existing buildings from the medieval period. Traces of this building we can still observe in some parts of the palace. In 1511 the palazzo became the property of the Cardinal Volterra Francesco Soderini. And in this time uh, we made uh, some developments of the courtyard around which uh, this building is constructed. The palace then became a diplomatic residence in uh, 1523 uh, before being uh, acquired in 1568 uh, by uh, the Austrian Cardinal Marco Sicico Altems, nephew of Pope Pius IV. The Cardinal established his own residence in the palazzo. He decorated it with paintings and installed a great collection of antiquities and his precious library of rare books. The Artem's family remained uh, in the palazzo until the mid of 19th century. Then it was inherited uh, by Giulio Hardoin, whose daughter, Duchess Maria Hardoin di Halese, married the poet Gabriel D'Annunzio in uh, 1883 in the palazzo church of uh, San Ancheto. And in the end of uh, the century, the building was sold to the Holy See. The Holy See also called uh, the Sea of Rome, Petrine Sea or Apostolic Sea, is the jurisdiction of uh, the Pope in his uh, role as uh, Bishop of Rome. In 1982, the Italian government initiated some restorations in the building. And uh, the museum was opened to the public in 1997. Pan and Daphnis. The composition is a Roman copy derived uh, from a Greek original by Heliodorus, a sculptor from Rhodos. The god Pan is teaching uh, the sheepherd uh, Daphnis to play the syrinx, a typical uh, sheepherd musical instrument made from marsh reeds. A Greek mythology is, uh, tells uh, that the god Pan was uh, a deity of uh, the countryside, forest, and pastures. He was half man and half god. One day, Pan saw a daughter of uh, the river god Ladon called uh, Surinx and uh, fell in love with her. However, when she had seen him, she was scared and escaped from his sight uh, to Mount uh, Lucarius to join her sisters. They, to save her from uh, Pan's harassment, turned her into a reed. When she, the wind blew, the air hit the reeds, making melodious music. The god Pan, who did not know which reeds uh, his uh, beloved maiden has become, cut seven reeds from uh, different lanes and joined them side by side. So he created a musical instrument that was called Surinx. After the poor maid and uh, is known to descendants as Pan's uh, flute. We are in the church of San Aniceto. 
This church was constructed in the 17th century by Giovanni Angelo Altens, nephew of Cardinal Marco Sitico, and it was dedicated to Aniceto, one of the first popes. Asclepius, God of Medicine, Son of Apollo, God of Helen, Truth and Prophecy, and the mortal princess Coronis, Zeus, afraid that Asclepius might render all men immortal, slave him with the thunderbolt. Apollo slew the Cyclopus who had made uh, the thunderbolt and was then forced by Zeus uh, to serve Admetus.
Heracles, one of the best known heroes in ancient mythology. According to legend, his father was Zeus and his mother was Alcimene, the granddaughter of the hero Perseus. Arrest and Electra. Electra in Greek legend, the daughter of Agamemnon and uh, Clytemnestra, she saved uh, the life of her young brother Arrest by sending him away when their father was murdered. That's all for today. Thank you for watching this video, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next historical places.